Hi guys, it's Matt Taylor here from the Money Rise team. Hope you're all keeping safe and well. Um, in today's video, I'm going to be talking to you about a benefit called the discretionary housing payment. Some of you though might know this benefit is being called a DHP. Um, a DHP can help you with lots of different things such as the benefit cap. So if your benefits have been uh, recently been capped, then a DHP is a perfect way to help you recoup some of that money uh, to ensure that you're not too out of pocket. Um, a DHP can also help you with the cost of the bedroom tax. So you may find yourself that you have one or two spare bedrooms and as a result your income has been reduced. So a DHP is a perfect way to help you cover the cost of the bedroom tax. Um, a DHP can also help you with the cost of moving. Um, so you may find that because you're affected by the bedroom tax you decide that, you would, that you're going to downsize your property uh, and a DHP can help you cover the cost of moving. So this should ensure that you're not out of pocket. Um, just to make, let you know though that you can only apply for a DHP if you are currently getting housing benefit or universal credit. How much you will get though will depend on your circumstances and your circumstances alone. Each and every individual case is different so all, pay, all payments will vary. Um, if you are awarded a DHP uh, you will get an award letter and on this letter you will have a date that your DHP will expire. Um, so make note of this date because once this date does expire your payments will stop too. Um, but you can apply for a DHP again once your date uh, expires but you have to apply and just because you got it the first time it doesn't mean you're going to get it the second time um, but un until you apply then you're never going to know. If you feel like you would like help applying for a DHP or just want more information you can contact myself or the MoneyWise team where myself or one of the team are more than happy to provide you with any help or advice or even help you with the application if, if you want this done um, or you can go directly to a Monmouthshire County Council uh, and make the application there um, or you can go onto the gov.uk website where there's lots more information about this benefit and other benefits that you may be eligible for so thank you again for taking the time to watch this video please get in touch if you want any help stay safe and hopefully I'll see you in the, sometime in the future bye